search for tomorrow. Brought to you by Dash, the safe sudsing detergent that gives you outstanding cleaning in your automatic. Washing through rinsing. Now get your things together and come along back to the hotel with us, Marion. If you don't, it's going to be pretty bad with Mr. Gibson. I'm not going with you, Dad. Marion. And furthermore, I am not going through with the trial. You don't have any choice about that, Marion. You've retained me as your counsel. I've spent a great deal of time and money on your behalf. You just can't shrug that off now. Don't let them frighten you, Marion. You needn't go with them. Mr. Gibson can't force you to go. It isn't only Mr. Gibson, Mrs. Metcalf. Marion knows what I have done for her and her little boy. Now, Marion, I'm your father. How can you do this to me? Mr. Gibson said that I wouldn't have to go to court. We'll speak about that further, Marion, but not here and not now. Now, come along, please. We're going back to the hotel where I paid for your room, even though you didn't use it for a long time. Marion, you don't have to go with him if you don't want to, and I know you don't want to. Marion, you come. Marion. Marion, don't go with them. Don't let them take you. Marion, Marion, scream! I wouldn't advise that, Mrs. Metcalf. This would make a very interesting newspaper story, wouldn't it? Marion! Joanne, it's Allison. Yes, dear, what is it? They found Marion. Her father and, and Gibson were here, and they've taken her away. Taken her away? Yes. How could they do that? Oh, they, they forced her. They just took her by the arms and walked her out. Well, they can't. Did, did you call the police? Oh, no, maybe I should have, but I was afraid of the publicity. Oh, of course, you're right. Let me think. I don't dare tell Arthur. Allison... I'll call John Austin and tell him to come to your apartment. I'll meet you both there. All right. You know Fred's gone to New York to meet Marion's little boy at the plane. He's going to bring him here. Oh. That's right. Allison, don't worry. I I'm sure John will help us. Is there anything I should do? No, don't do anything now, dear. Just wait till we get there. All right, I'll wait. Thank heavens you're coming. I'll come as soon as I can. All right, goodbye, Joanne. Bye, dear. <laughs> Don't dare buy that automatic till you've seen it wash. All right. Let's do a load in our demonstration tumbler with Dash. Dash? The detergent Montgomery Ward packs at the factory in every Imperial washer dryer. <laughs> Any soap would do. Not for modern automatics. Safe sudsing Dash prevents over sudsing machine failures. You'll have cleaning failures without heaping suds. Well, now, our demonstration towels are particularly dirty. Dash gives us the best cleaning possible. That's one reason Wards recommends Dash. Rather have a woman's word on cleaning. More women use Dash in these machines than any other product, but judge for yourself. Remember, the Wards Imperial has four wash cycles. It washes and dries with two simple settings, while Dash keeps suds safe. Incredible cleaning. Sign the sales slip, Ethel, and never use anything but Dash. Hi, dear. Hello, Joanne. Is John here? No, not yet. I guess he'll be here any minute. Did you tell Arthur? No, he was asleep. I left him a note in case he woke up and wondered where I was. Do you think this means they'll go ahead with a lawsuit immediately? I hope not. Oh, that'll be John. Hello, Mr. Austin. Come in. Oh, John is nice to come. I just got here myself. Well, sit down. Allison will tell us what's happened. Well, I can still hardly believe it, Joe. You say that Peter Rand and Gibson came here and took Marion Rand away by force? Yes. Well, they led her out. They didn't carry her. But she protested every inch of the way. Would you say, Mrs. Metcalf, that she did everything in her power to resist them? Well, I don't know. She, she didn't scream or anything like that. She walked, but they had hold of her arms. Mm -hmm. 
Well, I doubt whether that would hold up legally as kidnapping or anything like that, her own father and her own attorney, if she didn't resist with all her will, all her strength. I think it could be argued that she went voluntarily. In other words, she may have preferred not to go, but she went rather than make a scene. Now, that's regarded as voluntary. Is there anything we can do to help her? Not unless she wants to be helped. It's up to her. She's an adult, supposed to be able to exert her own will. Now, they certainly can't make her do anything she refuses to do. But they did. She didn't want to go with them, and they made her go. John, I know she didn't want to go on with the trial. She told me that herself. It must be true or she wouldn't have run out. Well, she didn't want to start the lawsuit in the first place. But her father and Gibson managed to influence her. Now, certainly it's not impossible that they can do it again. She changed her mind once. She can do it again. Well, can't we do something to stop them? Well, I think we may be in a somewhat better position if they do come to trial. We can make Marion admit on the stand that she ran out on the case. But if we go to trial... John, you said yourself if... If she's on the stand, they'll use her reluctance to, to win sympathy. I'm sure that'll be a strategy. And if it goes to trial at all? Well, let's face it, Joe. It looks like we've lost this round. Now, where's Fred? He's been able to influence her before. He might still be able to do something. He's on his way back from New York with Marion's child. Her child? He's bringing the boy here? Yes, we arranged for the boy to board a flight in San Juan and Fred went to, the, to New York to meet him. He's bringing him back here. Now that Marion's gone, it'd be awful. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe we've got something. With the boy here. At least Marion will want to come back for him. He's our best bet. It'll give us one more chance at marrying. The best possible chance. John, you can't use the child to get at Marion. No, but she'll want to get in touch with us. She'll have to. It may be the only opportunity we have to win Marion back. Now, let's make the most of it. Until Marion tells us what she wants done with her child. Tell Harry our wash has given us trouble for. He's always promoting a new one. Now, to demonstrate this automatic with Dash. Harry, you selling Dash as well as Westinghouse laundromat? Well, they go together. They even come packed together. Every automatic manufacturer recommends Dash. What's Dash got? Safe suds to prevent oversudsing troubles. Hey, if you'd have used Dash, maybe our machine would still be working. I need lots of suds for cleaning. Let Dash prove differently. Your shirt's this grimy. <laughs> Heaven forbid. Watch Dash give them the best cleaning possible. This Westinghouse laundromat really performs. Multi-speed washing action tumbles wash 57 times a minute through Dash's safe, easy to rinse suds. Dash cleans divine, honey. Okay, we'll buy it, but... I know. Treat it right with Dash. I'd like to make this very clear, Marianne, that you came here of your own free will. You know I didn't want to come. No one forced you to. No one forced you to hire me as your attorney. No one forced you to declare that Arthur Tate is the father of your child. No one forced you to... Oh, can't you stop it, please? Marianne, I don't understand you. Mr. Gibson and I have done everything we possibly could for you. And he's been trying to see that you get to what's coming, you get what's coming to you. And he's trying to right a great wrong that has been done you, and this is the way you treat him. I don't understand it. I told you I didn't want to go into court. And I told you, Marion, that if Arthur Tate is unwilling to make a settlement, we'll have to go to court. If he wants all the publicity and the scandal that will arise from a court trial, that's up to him. We're not responsible for it. 
I can't do it. You are going to have to do it, Mary. You can't come this far and back out at the last minute. I have given a great deal of time to your case, Mary, and I've spent hundreds of dollars to see that justice was done you, and now you're acting like a hysterical schoolgirl. I just can't do it. I don't care what you call me. Marion, you are going to do it. I'm not going to mention what you owe me, but for five years I've devoted myself to taking care of you and your little boy, but that isn't what is important. What is important is what you owe Carl for what you've done to him and what you owe Mr. Gibson for all the help that he's tried to give you. Mr. Gibson, I'll earn money to pay you back. I'll pay it all back. It may take a long time, but I'll do what I can. Marion, this is nonsense. Now, what's gotten into you? It'll just... Why do you object to going to court? It'll just make everything worse for... for Carl, and, and worse for me, worse for everybody. The amount of money that the jury will award you will go a long way to make things seem a lot better, Marion. I don't care about money. It isn't just the money, Marion. It never has been. But it's just, and it's only just, that Arthur Tate should share his responsibility in this. And it's only right that little Carl should have all the help that's coming to him. Can't you see? It'll Marion, just... we're not going to talk any more about this. We are now going to go into the hotel. Your room is waiting for you. And after you've been able to calm down and think things over a bit, I'm sure you're going to feel better. And please don't make a scene on the street or in the lobby. You wouldn't want this story to get into the newspapers now, would you? No, of course I wouldn't. All right, then let's go. And quietly. Yes. Come now. Come on, Marion. I can't. I can't. Marion, come back here. Marion, look out! Marion! Marion! morning is special and mom's getting the credit. Hey Betty, this shirt will be great to drive in. You got it so soft. Mother, my sweater is fine now. It doesn't cling. Hey mom, what a towel. You got it so fluffy. Well, but let's give credit where it's due. Downy. Downy fabric softener, new from Procter & Gamble. A little downy in the final rinse gives every wash load deep downy softness. Makes remarkable things happen. Like ironing. Things dry so soft and smooth, my iron almost glides by itself. And baby's clothes. They're not scratchy anymore. Leave it to downy to get shirts soft, make towels fluffy, take static cling out of synthetics. While I get all the credit. New. Downey Fabric Softener. Tomorrow is brought to you by Downey Fabric Softener, the new wash day discovery that rinses deep downy softness into everything you wash. Dishwasher give you spots again? Don't grab a dish towel, change to Cascade. Most spots start with water drops. See, even clean water forms drops that dry into spots. But look, only Cascade has Chlorochene to slide water off in sheets. Eliminates drops that dry into spots. You've never seen cleaner, more sparkling dishes because Cascade is unsurpassed at stopping spots. No wonder more dishwasher owners use Cascade than any other product.